After years of studying, Marta has finally obtained her degree in journalism. Like her, every year 4.7 million young Europeans gain a higher education qualification. No more student life, parties and happy hours. Time to think about earning a living now. Better head to the labour market. Will Marta be a journalist? A community manager? A press attaché? The possibilities are infinite. But this is where it gets complicated. Meetings and interviews, motivational letters and CVs. She knocks on every door and can only find internships or casual work. Getting into the labour market is really hard. Just a few weeks after the end of their studies, more and more of them are still unemployed, swelling the ranks of young people looking for a job. To avoid having to talk about a lost generation, the union has decided to act. With the creation of a European plan, prepared by the Commission, supported by MEPs and developed in the 28 member states. The Youth Guarantee. The idea of this youth guarantee is to give people under the age of 25 a good quality offer of a job, internship or training within four months of becoming unemployed or after leaving education. The aim is to get people into work quickly and lastingly. But what is it in practice? An insurance contract? Another promise? Young people are demanding practical measures. It's a plan wanted and encouraged by all the EU institutions and set up by national authorities in all of the 28 member states, each in their own way. But stakeholders in education, employment and the economy are all committed to working together. This guarantee has a budget of 6 billion euros, most of which will be spent by 2015 in order to move fast. And it's needed. Today, over 5.5 million Europeans under the age of 25 are unemployed. It's over half of young Spaniards or Croats and up to 58.3% for young Greeks. Germany remains under the level of 10%. The youth guarantee will be put in place in the coming months. And for Marta as for others, the effects should be felt by the end of 2014.